Hockey trivia, round two. Seeing if people can redeem themselves from their efforts last time. Let's see how they do. First question. How long is the NHL ice surface? <laughs> it's gotta be 72 feet. Jesus. No, 100. Is it 100? I got no clue. I have coming no out with a I have, tough one right out of the gate. 200 feet. 200 feet. 200 feet. 200 feet. Final answer? Mm-hmm. One for one. <laughs> huge, huge. I feel like I have 72, and for some reason, I feel like I'm thinking 90. Oh my god. It's too, I want to say it's like 200 feet. Two, <laughs> 200 something. How confident are you in 72? It just sounds no, like, but 100, 100 sounds good too. Beat. Between 200 and 225, I want to say. This is hard already. Yeah. This is supposed God to be easy. It. I don't know, I don't know do distances. You ever, do you ever play hockey? Metric systems confuse me and all that sort of stuff. Conversions, yeah. I don't do good with that. 100 feet sounds like the Olympic size. Okay. I don't know though. If you want to <laughs> just fucking go 90? Let's just go 200 feet. All right, yeah. Final okay. answer? Final 200 answer, 200, 200 feet. feet. Good work, fellas. One for no. one. <laughs> Here we go. Dad came through. Dad came through. Let's go with 90. 90. 90 final answer. 110 feet off. That's 200 feet. All right. Second question. The Quebec Nordiques relocated in 1995. What team did they become? This is the Colorado Avalanche, right? Yeah. Yeah, they're the apps. Colorado. Colorado. <laughs> Colorado Avalanche. Mm. Nordiques relocated in 1995. Colorado Avalanche final answer. I mean, just give Let it him a read the question. Yeah, for fuck's sake. <laughs> yeah, no. yeah, definitely. Yeah, definitely. They, they're, they're, they got the, the jersey. Yeah, the alternates. Yeah, yeah. yeah, definitely. Final answer? Colorado Avalanche. Yeah, Colorado Avalanche. Correct. Good work, fellas. Third question. Which one of these goalies won a Stanley Cup as a rookie? Where'd Steve Mason play? Steve Mason. The Cam Ward, Steve Mason. Are the, no, Cam, I mean, Steve Mason's the only one I don't really know. Cam Ward. Who Cam no. Ward played for? He like played for the Hurricanes, teams. right? It's Cam Ward. Sure. It's okay. gotta be because of Carolina. Yeah. That was Cam Ward. Edmonton, right? Yeah, and the Let's other guys something like the other guys wore on the cops, so it's Cam Ward. Yeah. Cam Final Ward. answer? Final yeah. answer. Correct. What do you think? You choose. Yeah. Okay. I don't care. Okay, we're gonna go. Final answer, Steve Mason. Cam Ward. Cam Ward. Sick team. Cam Ward, final answer. Yeah. First one wrong. It was Cam Ward. Oh my I did not think For he was a rookie. Carolina? That year. Yeah, Carolina. Fuck. We had the right team. I just didn't think he was a rookie that year when they won. Based on this career path, name the player. Anaheim, Edmonton, New Jersey, St. Louis, Tampa Bay. Holy shit. This isn't a Niederbeyer, is it? Oh. Scott Niederbeyer. Maybe? I'm trying to run through rosters. Yeah, me too. Is this a guy that won a Stanley Cup? Started in Anaheim. In Anaheim? Oh, good call. I think it might be, uh, no, it's not Dustin Penner. I was going to say Corey Perry had has been through a lot lately. Mm -hmm. but no, it would have been Montreal would have been in there. Can't be Kuhn, not Kuhn. It's uh, Lupo. It's not Lupo. It's no Leafs. Yeah. I'm trying to think of people who like, just jump from these teams. Chris Pronger? I saw Anaheim to Edmonton, and I thought it was Pronger. I was like, he never played for the rest of the. He didn't play for New Jersey or Tampa. Bergeron? Ryan Whitney, and then the one... He's probably an older player. Pat Maroon. I'm pretty confident he played for New Jersey. I don't know, but he definitely played for the other four teams. Yeah. And I know he Tampa's the most recent team he played for, and then it was St. Yeah, Louis before. Because yeah, he won back-to-back -back he won three cups yeah. in a row. Fuck it. Pat Maroon. Final answer. Good work, Jared. Hey! Focus one by minutes on Let's that go. one. I was going to say Pat, it's not Pat Maroon. Can I just say Pat Maroon? Yeah. Yeah. I think Pat Maroon's the correct answer. That's great work right there. Good job, Johnny. Our final answer is going to be, he's a great player. <laughs> Plays forward. All right, you didn't get it right. Uh, yeah, we're going to go ladder slap Schmidt. final answer. I don't think that's right. It's not the player I had. It's uh, Big Rig, Pat Maroon. Oh, it is Pat Maroon. Who was chosen earlier in their respective draft? David Pasternak or Joel Eriksson-Eck? 
I think that Joel Eric's neck was 25th overall, and Pasternak was either 24th or 26th. You want to know what else I'm thinking about? Is that last time we saw a question kind of like this, and I said, the obvious answer is saying that Eric's neck went first because it's crazier, right? Yeah. But then I also think that Avery might have learned from it last time, and Pasternak indeed went before it. Passo was late. This is just fucking Avery trying to fuck with us. For this one, I'm trying to get in Avery's head. I know. There's Pasternak feels like he should be the answer. Yeah. Which makes me think Avery would make it. Joel Eric's neck. They're one pick apart. They're both in the 20s in the, the 2013 or 2014 draft. See, Pasta was like, what, 20-something? Oh, Gianni would have known this one. That's annoying. Joel Eriksson. Joel Eric Eriksson. We're going to go Eriksson. Right. Good work. Okay, Joel Eriksson. Yeah. Eriksson, final answer. Correct, boys. Worked through that well. Yes. Was it like one pick yes. apart? Yes! I, I, I maybe, I kind of want to go with Pasta. I think it's a trick question. Yeah, let's do it. Let's right. go with Pasta. That was purely based off your brain. Joel Erickson F is the correct answer. Fuck. How many Gordy Howe hat tricks did Gordy Howe have? Two, seven, or 12? I know we didn't have a lot. I think Messier like leads with like eight. I know you didn't have that many, I'm pretty sure. Mm -hmm. right? I feel like two sounds like a good answer. Really? You think he only got two and they would name it a Gordy Howe hat trick? I think that was like the thing, was that he didn't get that many. Can't be two, right? No. Like, can't be two. It's called the It's not Gordie that Howe much though. Like, yeah. assist, goal. Fight. Fight. Is this going to fight? I'm gonna have to trust you on this because I've I would have no idea. I would have if it was me alone. I would have crossed out two immediately because I wouldn't think he'd get that many if it's called a Gordy Howe hat trick. Maybe but I'm just you, I'm, maybe I'm going right. with Avery Brain again. <laughs> I feel like he's trying to trick us. Do we have an answer? <laughs> Whatever you want to do. All right, here. let's do it two. Two. Correct. Oh. You're in it. You're in my head. <laughs> two. I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm good with you saying that that quickly. I think it's two. I think it's not many. I'll go with two. <laughs> Final answer? Yeah. yeah. Correct. Nice. Two. Final answer? Oh Twelve. Twelve. It was two. What? Okay, this Latvian-born player oh, had the most fuck. votes for the 2015 All-Star Game in Buffalo. Who uh, is it? It's got to be your guy. It's got to be fucking Andrew. <laughs> uh, Gergersons. Gergensons? Gergensons, yeah. I can't say his name. It's like Gergensen or some shit like that. Zemgus? Uh, Zegmus? Um, Zem Zed Zemgus Gergensen? Ger yeah, I'm Zemgus. Zegmus. <laughs> Zegmus Does pronunciation have to be fully correct? Is that it? Like, right. Is that the dude? Right? It sounds right. That, that sounds, sounds like a Latvian name. Yeah. That, that name that we Final answer. For. Zemgus yeah. Gergensen. Yeah. You said his name right too, correct? Let's go, fellas. I think last name was correct. Yeah. Cor Zemgus Gergensen. Yeah, Zemgus Gergensen's final answer. Zemgis Gergensen's Latvian locomotive. Zegman <laughs> Lurkensing. Uh, Johnny was right, Danny wasn't right, I'll take his answer. Need one right now or else you're wrong. I mean, I'm not gonna be able to, I don't even know his, where to start fucking. All right, I'll tell you the answer. It was Zemgis Gergensen's. That was not who I was thinking I know. I I, who was I thinking of? I thought you were thinking about Finneganov for a little no, bit. No, no. Um, I gotta research it. He got, I'm pretty sure he was Latvian. In 1967, the NHL expanded from six to 12 teams. Oh. Name three of the six new teams. Okay, Philadelphia, St. Louis. Gotta think the Flyers for one of them. Vancouver, Edmonton. The next six are like St. Louis, Pittsburgh, Philly, Buffalo, California, Minnesota. You named five of the Flyers, Blues, Kings. I'm thinking Pittsburgh. Yeah. Did we say New Nordiques? Islanders? Edmonton, Vancouver, oh, Edmonton, Pittsburgh, LA. Final answer. Only got two of three. Edmonton was wrong. Damn it. <laughs> St. Louis Blues, Philadelphia Flyers, California Golden Seals, final answer. I'm going to give that to you, but they were Oakland at the time they came oh, in. Okay. But it was the right organization, so I'll give that to you. Okay. Good to hear. I don't know why you didn't say the other ones that you liked. <laughs> like, all, like pretty much all of them. <laughs> Buffalo was wrong, but every other one you said See, was wrong. that's why I didn't know for sure. Was Pittsburgh one of them? Yeah. Flyers, Blues, Penguins. Final answer. Good work, Jer. Correct. There you go. Setting up my game a little bit this <laughs> week. Pittsburgh, LA, California Golden Seals. Final answer. Yeah. Yeah. I'll give that to you, California. You're correct. Three for three. Come All right, on. our winners. Danny, how does it feel to win this week? It feels fabulous. <laughs> I'm ecstatic. Uh, Johnny, were the questions too easy for you? Um, I think Danny really helped me with them. It was kind of tough, but she, she guided me. Dream team, congrats. Thank you. Thanks for tuning in. Make sure you like, subscribe, comment what you want to see next time. Thank you for watching.